Hi everybody, today is Thursday, February 11th, and I'm um, gonna dive into our conversation about finances. It was really cool because I made this video, um, I guess like maybe two videos ago, talking about some things I wanna discuss on the channel coming up, and one of those things was finances because I plan on being debt free this year. And yesterday, uh, our pastor's wife was teaching Bible study and we talked about finances. And it was really cool because it was a great reminder about the importance of finances and how we answer to God for how we spend money. So I'm, I'm excited and it was for me when I have those moments of like I talk about when I do a video and then I hear from somebody else like we're gonna be talking about this I get so excited because I feel like it's confirmation of like okay this is a good thing to discuss so I'm really excited and um, today I spent some time going over my budget and yeah just kind of really making sure it's something that I can stick to, that it makes sense, that it's accurate. You know, like there are things that based on COVID, my expenses changed from the last time I did my budget. So I did a, I did a budget, um, an updated budget from what I was using before, one that is more accurate um, and then just has different guidelines and boundaries I'll be sticking to just in this season of working towards being debt free. So I'm really excited to kind of put pen to paper and, well, a computer, um, but to kind of have a plan in place and to start working on it. A lot of the changes are gonna start next month, um, but even like having it in place now helps prepare me mentally. And I'm so excited. Like I think about, I mean, to me, that's just been such a big thing, you know, just in terms of things I want to do and move forward in I want to have good credit and I want to be debt free so that way there's not these other obstacles in the way to come and yeah I'm just really excited to like be making steps towards being debt free and I just I'm just really excited so um I'll be getting keeping guys up to date and um so yeah stay tuned and keep me in prayer because this is gonna be no small task but I am trusting God and um I have some big goals about things I want to give, things I want to have in savings. I, you know, my friend Angelica and I, we talk about this. We want to retire our parents. Like, I want them to be in a place where they're not worried about anything financially. That's my goal. When I was um, in fifth grade, I saw my paternal parents move in with us. And I saw firsthand my parents take care of my grandparents. and. I can't even, I, I need to do a whole other video to just tell you guys about the significance of that season of life. Um, Cause it, it taught me so much. But one thing it taught me is just, I had such a, um, I like my parents anyway, but my respect and my admiration for them grew because they went through some things, you know, caring my grandparents, living in a house with eight people. The Bible says we're to honor our parents and I'm very grateful for them. And I want to retire them. I don't want them to I mean, they can work if they want, but I don't want them to have to work to survive. I don't want them to live paycheck to paycheck, but I can't really help them if I'm still living paycheck to paycheck. So yeah, even that is just kind of factoring in and just really excited about just getting my finances in order. I'm, I'm just over the moon. So, you know, tag along, check out the progress and um, yeah, pray for your girl. The other thing I want to talk about I don't know if I want to talk about it today because this video is actually a pretty good length right now. 